Alright, good morning ladies and gentlemen. So I'm going to show you how to use the Xbox 360 controller for Skyrim on the PC. And it's actually uh, pretty simple. So what you're going to want to do is, you got this open now, right? You're going to get your Xbox 360 controller that is wired. You see that? You're going to grab the USB, plug it into the port. And you should see it downloading. It should install automatically via Windows 7. Mine's already been installed, but it'll show you that it's installing the software. So your controller should be glowing on the top. So now you click play. And you should be able to move it. You see, you see my reflection on the on the laptop. So I'll try to make this nice and short. This won't work now if you have a controller like this. You can't be using this. This counts as a battery pack. This right here, you can't be using this with the next Xbox 360 controller like that, a wireless one. If you're going to be using a wireless one, you're going to need, a, I believe, a adapter for that to connect. But this won't work because this will just charge it on the laptop. You need this that, that has a built-in wire so it can connect immediately. And just for you, just for you know, uh, just so you know, if you need to activate it, you just go to your system. You go to your settings. You go to gameplay. And you have to have this with an X on it for it to work if you don't have it all on already, in case you're having any tr trouble. And that's pretty much it. That's all you need to do. And that's, that's it. So it's just that simple. Have a, 360 a wired 360 controller that's connected. And this will work. This I bought this at Walmart for $24.99. This is a mini power... EX, something like that. Uh, there's only one I could find in stock. It's pink, but it'll do. It's nice and handy. It's good. And this is a Toshiba laptop. It's pretty simple, so it'll connect with Windows 7. Hope this guy helped.